Oxford Canal South, uh, that way, where it's um, closed. Right, um, and we're standing in the canal. Now, if I've read my map rightly, I think here is the, here, here, possibly this tree, is the, is the silver medal point. Okay, we've passed the outskirts of Banbury. We're now out into the countryside, so this is definitely, definitely beyond the, the 30 mile line. Pit stop. Yeah. Stop talking about it. Yeah. <laughs> right, here's Somerton, and this is where we leave the canal to take to the road. We now hit Upper Hayford Air Force Base. So we're gonna run along the edge rather than run along the road. So this is the runway and those are the bunkers where the, the planes and no doubt the uh, ammunition would have been. So yeah, so it's now, it's like massive parking further on. They park cars there and vans there and you can rent yourself a nuclear proof uh, silo if you want but look at that that's really cool it's so really cool there's lots of businesses here's lunch we've got four minutes before the kitchen closes for orders so uh, three minutes three minutes let's go let's go unless jenny's already got the chips in normally i, I video lunch but lunch just when? <laughs> anyway. anyway, large, large vulture in the trees. Oh, there he goes, there he goes. Bloody hell, he's massive. Yeah, it's got to be a buzzard, isn't it? So, yeah, we just uh, set off from lunch. Only three of us now, but we're good, right? Yeah. We're good all the way to Oxford, I think. So, as we're running out of Bletchingdon, we're coming down the valley. We've got St. Mary's Church. Oh, Chris, where are you gone? We've got St. Mary's Church in Kidlington ahead of us. Is it here? Yeah, what's the, what's the poetry? So, Seasons of Mist and Mellow Fruitfulness, Oat Water by John Keats. Yeah. So up on the hill, you can see all the mist settling over Kidlington. Yeah. And round the church spire. And with all the orangey autumn leaves, it's really nice. It is lovely, it is lovely. And it's warmer as well than it than it might be. So it's not cold. It's quite pleasant. And we're feeling good. Yeah. Oh yeah. Good, good. After, after a nice lunch, yeah, lunch. chips, <laughs> chips and pizza. And frankly, if you can't run after chips and pizza, are you really an ultra runner? Hang on. There we go. We're in Oxford. Woohoo! This is it. Bye bye. That's it. Yeah. So uh, I'm now on my own, but. It's okay, has someone got the distance? Uh, I reckon that was, oh I have, it's about 22, we, 21 and a quarter, 22 and a quarter miles. Just short of a marathon, but hey ho, this is it's about as Oxford as you can get. So, there we go, it's just over 40k, Banbury to Oxford. Let me go for a little bit further. One marathon. <laughs> it's not bad to go in, is it? We've adjusted our race goals. So firstly, we've got to reach the starting line without injury. Uh, and that has to be the number one goal. Secondly, and I think the major goal is let's hit Banbury, bag the silver medal. And do you know what? I'll be happy with that. I don't think it's realistic that I'm going to do the 50 miles, oh no, 60, sorry, and get the gold medal. Best case scenario, I'm finishing that about half past eight at night. And after going through the night, I felt rubbish for the rest of the day. And I'm really, really not going to want to be running until half past eight in the evening. So I think my stretch goal will be to make it to Kirtlington. That little bit today that we did up until up until lunch, very much a stretch goal. Can then 
see how things are going and possibly in the best case scenario we just keep going south uh, possibly make Oxford possibly just stop at uh, uh, at uh, somewhere along the, way, along the way Hampton Poor perhaps but all the way to Dorchester yeah no not gonna happen let's just scratch that one off but today it's been a really good run really good felt really strong great company cracking run and there we're on at 43 and a half and a half K uh, I guess if I turn to home now it's gonna be 45 when I get home yeah that will probably do 55k on the schedule but that's for a 100k plan and if I'm not running 100k I don't have to put in those that extra what it be 12k uh, distance let's just accept where I am enjoy it which I think is the key thing not risk injury and we're good <laughs> <laughs>